Hey, this is Ray uh, with Turnkey Flyers, and in this video I'm going to show you how to convert your flyer template into a JPEG so that you can email it and the person that you email it to won't be able to edit it. And uh, so this is useful because uh, it's, it's easier to send, it's, it's smaller, and they won't have to open it in Adobe Reader, they can just open it uh, in their email client. So here's the flyer that we've completed. Um, to, to do this, make sure you've gone through the previous video, which is on resizing your template to make it smaller. Uh, you have to do that, otherwise this, this uh, process might not work. So the first thing you do once you've created your, your email uh, PDF uh, file with all the reduced images, all the images have been reduced in size, and we have, a, we have now an email version that's much smaller than the original. What we're going to do is go to uh, this website called gotoconvert.com. That's G-O, the number two. Uh, convert c o n v e r t dot com, and we scroll down and we click browse. And what we want to do is find our email uh, flyer that we created. Click open, and then we want to resize. So we check that box, and we choose uh, down here. We choose eight hundred by six hundred. And you can put your email address if you want it to be uh, emailed in there, but I'm just going to click uh, Convert Now. So now it's going to upload, and it's going to take a little while to upload, so I'm just going to pause it. So now, uh, what you're going to want to do is scroll down when that's done, and don't pay attention to these giant download buttons, those are actually ads. You want to scroll down until you see this button right here where it says download now. So we want to click that and we want to, we want to save it somewhere. So we can just give it a name like street address and we click save. Make sure we know where it is. Click save. And now let's, let's open that and see what it looks like. So there we go, we have the exact flyer uh, in an, ed an uneditable form. So we can email that to someone. And we can, it's high quality so they can zoom in and read, read the text. And we can just attach this to an email and uh, they can get it and they won't be able to change it but it'll be much easier for you and much easier for them. So there you go.